time for another paint party. I have a 12 inch by 12 inch square canvas sitting on top of a cutting board that's on top of a spin table inside of a kiddie pool. That is my uh, normal setup for uh, anytime I'm going to spin something. We're going to do a split cut pour. The colors will be provided in the description as I typically do, but I will give you a little peek at the colors here because I've already got it poured into our cup. So it's a little unusual uh, compared to uh, typical pours I've seen. I've not really seen anybody put those colors together. Um, I think it'll turn out good though. So uh, let's get started.
Okay, guys, I, I think that's where I'm going to stop. Um, I was spending more to try and get uh, these lines a little more open, but uh, I think that's the best I can do with it, uh, with the amount of paint that's left on the canvas. See a little something, uh, clump I need to get out. Kind of messed up my lines right there. Kind of try to correct it a little bit there. Still looks like too much paint. Okay, looks like another clump right there. I need to get out. Looks like too much. Something. Go ahead and get the camera down. Give you a close up. Wasn't really what I was going for, but I'm pretty happy with it. I think it's pretty cool. I'm afraid this, uh, this camera is not doing much justice for it, though. Now here, uh, here we have some good definition of some lines where the, the brown shows up. Some cool-looking formations here. This will look, on camera, this looks a lot darker than it does in real life, but it's probably actually more true to what it's going to look like when it dries because the colors do deepen as they dry. Got some cool looking, I guess you would call them cells. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, they have a iridescent kind of quality to them, pearlish looking, some of them. It's very different, I have to say, this is very different, not my typical and that's why I like it. I, you know, this is definitely uh, not what I thought how this would come out. <laughs> I have to say, but uh, I I do think it's pretty cool. So uh, that's going to be it for today. Uh, I will uh, wrap it up. Hope you have a good day for the rest of your day and evening, whichever it may be. I will see you at the next paint party. Bye.